they're going they're going to do a documentary on me and they're, and they're making this this thing and I I hate it they think they're going to make a couple of bucks on this I disagree it's just so boring it's just like I don't you're not going to you're going to have to cut the, you're going to have to cut the chicks dancing or something you know you have to remember that this isn't a multi-million dollar picture to do a low budget movie would take three weeks or a month and then it became two weeks, and then they started shooting them in a week. My small films, sometimes I shoot them in three days. The name of the movie is The Witches of Brestwick. Big chase and a big chest. Add those two to the film, and you are gonna be a winner. Just make sure tits look huge. Make sure you have a little action, a couple of good looking babes. You can't really lose. Jim's biggest strength is his ability to get something done under the time constraints and the money constraints that he's facing. Let's talk about lights. Here's what I'd like to get. I'd like to get two lights. Something that lights breasts really well. Mm, some soft lights? Yes. Okay. I've worked with some directors that would just rush through everything. They just want to get it done. We're ready, so do it, do it, do it. While we're young, Anytime, guys. I don't know what they're doing. They're idiots. Full-fledged, card-carrying, all-American idiots. When Jim has something to communicate, um, he kind of tends to bark it at you. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a, cut it. What's the problem? We can't. We don't know when we're ready for them. We've been sitting down there waiting for you. Idiots. No, but you know we normally say rolling. All right. Speed. Here, we, here we go. Here we go. You know. He doesn't always have the patience to understand that you can't read his mind and you don't know what the heck he's talking about. All right, guys, cut, cut. Turn the car off. When he's f making a movie, he gets very caught up in all that that entails. And he, he's a Leo. And his theory is if you're not going to do your job, I'll do it for you. What's he doing? You want me to do this show? Just get out, let me do it and he will get very caught up in wearing a million hats. I'm each up there. And get angry about it, but he'll take it on. At least if I break it myself. Oh, fuck, what a stud in the seat. Why don't you wait on the patio? No, 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 no. Jim isn't exactly the most tactful person on the planet. Let's see your dresser. You won't need it. No, I don't hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. He is rude, insensitive, uncompassionate, and just downright dirty. And I don't like it. Smile and go. I smirked. You're not where he's at. And it was an evil smirk, and then it went to a smile. He's not a very, very nice. sensitive guy. All right, this is a lesson for all you stupid, 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 stupid chicks out in Hollywood. And there's plenty of you. Uh, that would be great. Is there a number on here? Um, I don't have a pen, but I can call you up and leave my number on your voicemail. Just do that. Okay, well, do you have a resume with a number on it so I can call you? No, I don't have a resume. In terms of Jim directing emotion, you know, he really leaves it up to the actor. Oh, uh, oh cut, cut. Uh, Joe, uh, I don't want to see your face. I want to see her face, okay? So get it's up. my fault I turned my head. Don't, well, turn, Joe, turn your head. You look at the woods over there and let her look at the camera, okay? He cares. You know, he's an artist. He wants it to be right. I guess Picasso painted pictures and I'm not Picasso. I'm more like the guy who paints Elvis on velvet, but uh, I still like what I do. I love what I do. Ready and action. 